Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a Zaffle try on haul. Everything that I got is recent, so if you are interested, I will have the links to everything down below, but you can just check it out at zaffle.com. A lot of the things I would wear, but there's three outfits that I pushed myself out of my comfort zone for that I wouldn't normally wear, but I think I can pull them off, I think. I gained about 20 to 25 pounds since I moved here. When I, when I got here, and I just felt like, okay, now I can restart my life, get my stuff together. I felt a lot better about everything, about myself, and I started eating more. And I love the way that my body looks now. I feel so confident. Like, I feel like things just filled out a lot more, and I, yeah, I'm, re I'm really, I'm honestly really happy right now. But my entire wardrobe is full of size extra smalls and smalls which I can fit into, keyword fit into, but that doesn't mean it actually is gonna look good on me. I definitely have moved up in size and you guys will probably be able to tell <laughs> that I've gained weight. Um, yeah, so that happened. <laughs> but the good thing is that I feel so much better now. I just like love life and I love, I honestly, I love eating, so I'm happy. I'm, I'm just doing my thing right now, guys. All right, so if you guys would like to see the haul, then please keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell for more videos so you can get notified. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it and want more like this. And don't forget to leave a comment down below letting me know what your favorite fall piece of clothing is. All right, let's go ahead and get started. First up is this shirt that I'm wearing right here that I absolutely love. And this is one of the items on Zaffle that had so many reviews. And I truly believe it's because it's one of those tops that just looks good on everybody. Anyone can wear it, it is so easy to style. I got the one in white just because I love the way white looks now with me with paler skin. <laughs> Um, with the darker hair, off the shoulder type vibe, and, and I love that it's not too tight around my arms. I'm not sure what size this is since I'm wearing it right now. Um, it might have been a one size, and I love that it's ribbed. I am wearing it with these denim jeans. This is like a light wash. The way that it makes your butt look. It gives that perfect like peachy pear shape. And I think it's the way that the pockets are in the back. It's just like perfect placement, perfect size. From honestly anywhere, any online website, it's so easy to buy tops, right? Not jeans like or pants. It's just hard for, that, for it to fit you properly. You know, there's like a lot of measurements that go into it. Like I, for example, have bigger legs. I was afraid that maybe my quads wouldn't fit into the jeans and that has happened before where it fits my waist but not my quads. <laughs> But these are stretchy, it's kind of like a jegging material, so even though it looks like denim, it's definitely like a stretchy kind of denim. So I have two other tops that I wanted to show you guys with these jeans, and then all the other outfits are like completely different. This is a wrap crop sweater in this beautiful rose color. I have always wanted a shirt like this that was like sweater material, but not, like it looks like a sweater, but it doesn't actually have the material of a thick sweater because I live in Florida. I can't be wearing heavy, thick sweaters and I actually had a really thick one in my cart and I'm like, all right, Kaylee, let's be real. You're never gonna, you're never gonna wear that ever unless you move and that's not happening. I love it in Florida. So I needed to find something that was thin. Like this is so thin. It weighs like nothing. The wrap comes pretty high up. So it covers my bra, but I feel like it's just showing a little bit too much skin in the front. So what you can do is like a little fashion hack, get a safety pin and then you just connect the two sides like however low you want it from the inside. So that way you can't see the safety pin on the outside. I also wore this with the jeans. Um, I really love this color and I've been meaning to buy more outfits in this shade. It's like a minty green and I love it. I love this top so much. This is like your basic cropped tank cami. I love the size of the straps. There is no front and back. This is just like the same on both sides pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> it's a very comfortable soft material and they had it in a few different colors as well. Next up is an outfit I wanted to show you guys that I 
was a little bit like iffy about but I think it's actually pretty cute it's definitely in style right now the whole like schoolgirl vibe so I picked out this dress it has that like straight neckline really thin straps very form-fitted body con type dress I paired it with this cute top and it's funny because I'm like what am I gonna wear with this you know the ones okay so this is the long sleeve top that buttons in the front and then it's like the rest of it's open you guys have seen that right and I always wonder what like am I just supposed to not wear a bra because that's never ever happening in a million years I don't know how these girls like are looking so cute with those type of shirts so I was like all right let's pair these two together and let's see how it looks so that's what I did you guys are seeing that right now and I really really love it it gives that like schoolgirl type vibe but I gotta say I feel like it's very sexy um, but subtly sexy this is such a nice long sleeve like cropped cardigan oh my gosh and I'm happy I ended up getting white because it looks so cute with this dress one pieces or like jumpsuits are totally my thing just because it's so comfortable to wear I know a lot of you probably feel the same way and the reason why I love them so much is because it's, I feel like the bottom is like a jogger and then the top is a little bit more like fitted and um, cute like something that you would wear going out so it's kind of like a mixture of cozy but then everyday casual <laughs> right does anybody know what I'm talking about so I have this this, okay, this might be my favorite piece from the whole entire haul just because it's like that piece I'm gonna wear any chance that I get any it it, oh, it looks so cute anywhere that you go in it You can pair it with heels even and make it more dressy. It also has pockets Oh so perfect and you can tie it with a Wrap around the waist to make your waist even smaller and cinch that in you know how can how could I not this was one of the things that was in my cart the whole time that I was so indecisive about everything this was the one thing that was like constant for me that just stayed in the cart and didn't move at all yeah I think I'm gonna get this in black too because it is so comfortable and it is so incredibly adorable next I have these two here that I paired as an outfit so it is a black dress and this has that really cute um, thing in the front where it's like that peasant top look where it's like scrunchy and then it ties in a bow in the front. You guys know what I'm talking about, right? I saw this initially in tan and I was going to almost buy it, but I'm so glad I didn't because I feel like the tan would have really like accentuated parts of my body that I didn't want to be accentuated, like my lower stomach, for example. Because sometimes with the body con, you gotta really be careful with the color that you pick. What's cool about this is that the straps actually come out here for the bow in the front. So by making this tighter, like in the front, you make the straps tighter too. So I paired it with this because I feel like it was kind of like boring on its own. It's really wrinkly right now. I need to steam it, <laughs> but for styling it, all I did was just like tied it in the front really tightly to cinch in the waist, left the buttons unbuttoned and kind of like opened it up a bit so you could see that really cute detail on the black dress where it like does a little peasant top thing. And then I rolled up the sleeves. I forgot to show you these two that I got. I haven't worn these out yet, I'm afraid because they're white, but I've always wanted white, cute little white sneakers. It's just, I didn't want to pay a fortune for them. And they also came with Four, um shoelaces so if these happen to get like messed up um, frayed stained whatever I can't get it out then I'll just switch them out for the new ones so I kept those but yeah very comfortable and super stylish here's another outfit that I was a little bit iffy about um, but it turns out it fits me so well that I I'm cool with it like if if, I, if it had any type of fit issue whatsoever I probably would have returned it just because it is like that different for me so basically it's a set it comes with pants and then a little cute crop top the crop top cute like I'm always gonna I'm gonna wear that no matter what right but the pants it's kind of this work pant vibe 
like it really looks like work pants it feels like work pants it doesn't have a lining in it but i mean it feels like it would like it's that kind of pant pinstripe and i love when it's stripes like this for them to go down this way because that's going to make you look long and lean it is also super high-waisted but not only that like i would not have gotten this if it didn't have this right here you ready for it bam this goes around the belt loops and you can cinch your waist in and tie it really tight so it makes your waist look small. The only thing is I wish the back had pockets or like, you know, just like a straight pocket that just goes in just to give the butt a little bit more of like a lifted look. But other than that, the fit's perfect. I got it in a size medium and it really does fit my waist well. It's just that I like to cinch it in more than that. So I'll use that wrap to do it and the bottoms, I forgot to say, the bottoms a little bit too short, kind of like that high water look. So what I do is I just fold it up and then I'm good. I, I think maybe I just really, really love gray, but this is another piece that I, I gotta tell you, when I tried this on for the very first time, I was like, damn, I look like that. Like, have you ever tried something on and you look in the mirror and you're like, wait, that's me? That's, that's what happened when I put this on. It was like instant, confident boost. And I'm like, yeah, like really feeling myself like, girl, you gotta wear this out tomorrow. This is like a perfect sexy date night or day date dress. It has um, a deep V-neck with a zipper. So you can have this baby as low or as high as you want. I do it kind of like in the middle. It has short sleeves. It's like that cute little cap sleeve look. I love, 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 love how it um, has that sort of collar like that. It is mm, so sexy. I have a lot of tops like that actually just because I love that collared look. I feel like it just, man, oh man. I also got this dress, which I really love. I feel like it's not the color that I was expecting. It said mocha, but to me this looks a lot more pink. Definitely really cute for fall still, but I was hoping for more of like a tannish, nude, slightly pinkish color. The dress comes close to the neck up here, and then it is cut off sleeve, and then at the bottom, it, and on like along the sides, it ruches. So this string right here, it actually does not move the dress like if you wanted to go up higher and have the ruching be up higher you can't do that with the string it's just one of those strings that's literally sewed to the bottom and you can only make a bow out of it so just wanted to mention that um but i wouldn't have made it the ruching higher or the dress higher anyway because it's a perfect length to where it's not gonna like keep going up as you're walking um this is gonna look so good i think with like a trench coat maybe even some boots like ankle booties oh yes i got this dress this is another one i was not sure if i was gonna like but i feel like i see everywhere girls wearing like these cute like florally type dresses going to like picnics or to the beach or just like going to get brunch you know what i mean i wanted to have that like cute effortless casual dress that i could just throw on not have to think about anything and feel really comfortable but still look cute at the same time i love this color the same kind of like design where the tie in the front ends up tightening everything like even the shoulders so that way they don't fall down while you're wearing it but the thing that i love most about it is this like scrunchy part of the dress what it does is it cinches in the waist and then it flows out from there so if, for example you're like self-conscious about your stomach or you know you're gonna be eating a lot that day and you don't want anyone to see your food belly, this is the perfect dress for that. It's gonna cinch you in right where you need it to and then just so pretty. I love it. This was in red too, I think. I really wasn't sure about this top, but now that I've tried it on, I actually really love it. I ended up getting it in a size small and it actually does fit me well without being too tight. So this is a good size small to where it's like, you can definitely stretch it and fit in it nicely. Um, it's very similar to the first crop top I showed you, except that it's tie-dye. But the reason why I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it is because when I first got it and I looked at it, 
it looked almost as if coffee had been spilled on it, like it was stained. They had different colors, of course. I think they had like a blue one and a pink one. I just didn't like those colors because they were too bright and like crazy for me. I'm definitely more of like a um, earthy tone type person. So maybe because I'm a Taurus, actually, that makes a lot of sense. But I fell in love with this. I love the way it looks and I ended up pairing it with these sweatpants joggers. I was afraid since they're white that you could see straight through it, but the fabric is not see-through like that. So you can definitely wear, um, I would say a light colored thong underneath it and you, you won't see anything. But yeah, if you're like gonna go for black granny panty underwear, you'll probably see it. So it's not like completely see-through anything, but just be careful with your choice of underwear. But I love the way that this fits. High-waisted, you can make it tighter around the waist with these drawstrings, <laughs> drawstring. Um, it gets tighter on the ankle and yeah, just really nice. I always wanted a white pair of joggers and now I have some. And then I think this is the last thing that I got, this black skirt, but I'm not sure about it because it has these two um, cuts in the front and I feel like it kind of looks like a jack-o'-lantern. I wish I had gotten the one that only had one slit, but I, I, well, I mean, I have a skirt that's like that, that has one slit, but it's a little too tight on me. That's why I wanted to get this new one in the size medium. Um, I don't know, you guys will have to let me know what you think about it. I feel like I'm, I don't know if I like the two cuts in the front, but I wore it with this top, which is definitely very versatile, perfect fall color. You can wear this with jeans. It's a tan long sleeve top, it's a wrap top. So it goes around in the front and then you tie it in the back or you can wrap around another time and tie it in the front, side, whichever you prefer. But I love tops like this. Anything that like wraps in the front area is a great fit and it feels very good quality. I ended up getting it in a medium and yeah, I love it. All right guys, so that is it for this haul. If you liked it, please leave a thumbs up down below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time that I upload. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.